Mm-hmm. Dodo. Uh, let's just react to this real quick. Still oh, so there minutes. is, uh, well, there's a number of people that fall in this category. But this guy in particular, his name is Brian Johnson. He is a uh, biohacking longevity expert. You know, um, he says he's going to live, he's going to conquer death, right? And, and so, um, you know, this is what I see. I see this over and over again. You see, you know, I see some, some kind of rich dork that, you know, he gets middle aged and discovers by working out, putting on a little muscle, sleeping better, eating better. He feels a lot better, looks a lot better. Now, now he's going to solve death or live to 180 or whatever fantastic, ridiculous claims these people are making. Um, you know, I mean, I figured out lifting weights and, and taking care of his eat, and eating better at 14. I mean, these guys that suddenly, you know, they feel like shit, they live like crap for years, all of a sudden they... This guy thinks In-N-Out burgers without the bun is health food, by the way. They do a few the right things, and all of a sudden, and then they, of course, they, they attach their magic supplement stack. You know, this is always, uh, this is always part of it. I'm gonna, oh, you got to take my supplements or buy my fancy program for just $90, $99 a month. It'll say all the millions of dollars I spent, I'm, I'm saving it for you and turning this into some ridiculous, worthless thing. You know, he sits there and measures things that have no bearing. There's no clinical data. There we go. He is jealous that Brian Johnson has more money than he does. There's no human long-term data that would support anything. You know, he's all extrapolating it from animal data or you know, it's from cellular data. And therefore, I'm living, uh, going to live longer in reverse of my It's all BS, guys. Once you guys understand, this is a uh, sciencey sounding technologically, uh, you know, uh, sales job that people, unfortunately, people fall for, right? But one thing you'll never hear me make a claim on. I'm going to live forever. I'm going to live even longer than average. You'll never hear me make that claim because I have no clue. I have no idea. What you will see me claim is, hey, I'm, I'm in pretty decent shape. Just wait. The heart attack or stroke is coming any day now. I'm doing pretty good for my age, uh, relative to the average population. You know, as I get close to 60, I'm um, doing things that most, most people my age can't do. And it's, you know, it's because of lifestyle. It's because I exercise, I sleep, I eat well, I don't drink, I don't smoke, uh, you know, those type of things. Right? This basic simple stuff. You don't need a $99 supplement stack to enhance, right? It's all garbage guys. Stop falling for that stuff. Um, anyway, that's just something I want to get off my chest a little bit. And I see that, and I feel sorry for people to get ripped off of this stuff. And, you know, they, 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 he's... I will agree with Sean to some extent that Brian Johnson overemphasizes uh, the importance of things like epigenetic age markers. That sort of stuff is much more reliable in animal models like rats because one, they don't live long to begin with and they have a much faster metabolism. That's Johnny. You know, it's just like, it's, just, it's ridiculous. You know, I'm going to magically, uh, I'm going to uh, uh, test some imaginary bar- biomarker that I kind of just made up. You know, oh, this says I'm aging slower. Right, whatever, whatever. Show me. Okay. Here's what I will say. This is when I suggest you start. You know, it's funny. He's demanding Brian Johnson show him human data that, you know, shows that you live longer doing this. This guy ignores all conventional medical science in order to cope for his carnivore diet propaganda bullshit. Like, like as if this guy cares about scientific evidence. Pay attention. When you see 120 year old people walking around that are jacked, that are physically fit, that are mentally sharp, that are, that are robust, then I'd say, okay, well, maybe I have some data here. But until that time, don't fall for this crap, guys. Just do the basics. Get good sleep. Eat a diet that doesn't contain a bunch of garbage, right? Uh, focus on high quality nutrition. In my view, animal products are, are some of the absolute best. Uh, don't, uh, you know, you know, ex- uh. Okay, we're going to have to watch the Sparage video and shit.